I'm going to show uh, real quickly how to uh, use a pressure pass to beat his uh, knee shield from a half guard. And a couple of things I do here. This is the first uh, part of the series that's going to lead to uh, the whole uh, passing series involving like leg laces and leg locks, dog bars, some really cool stuff. But you got to get through the basics first. <clears throat> so I'm here, he's playing a proper knee shield. I like this hand to grip your the pants here. I kind of dig my knuckles into his knee and kind of lean on to He's not going to give up and it makes it a little more comfortable than just posting. And this also, by doing this, it makes it a little harder if he tries to pull. If I'm just here, he can pull it off easier. So I like this here, I punch. First thing I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get this below my center line so I can fold him down here. If I do this, I have some really cool stuff I can get into leg lace. But it, real quickly, just the pressure part. If he's here, if I can get it down. This hand's going to kind of grab his hip or belt, whatever I can get. I'm going to sprawl my legs back here. And depending on what he goes, I can walk around the front. And I can walk around that. Most guys don't let me push it down that easily. <laughs> when you try to push, they fight that for all the work. I know that's a typical reaction. So what I'm going to do is, as I push, if you don't push it back, I'm going to slide my hand to the front of his knee. I'm going to pull it out and behind my armpit. See, I'm, I'm getting in front of it. So I'm trying to, here, I'm trying to get it past the center line so I can fold it down. Or if I feel him pushing, I'm going to come here, I want to pull it past the center line on my ribs so I can tuck it in my armpit. At the same time that happens, I would take this hand, I'm going to punch it below my knee, put my shoulder to his far hip, and I'm going to straighten this out and bring my outside knee to his hip. Here, like this. He's going to lock it up more often than not, and I'm okay with that. That's what I want him to do. My arm's tucked deep to protect it from getting attacked with the Kimura. It's nice and deep. You can come see my arm, my left arm over here. My left arm is going to be tucked in here. My elbows below. My, my, my leg line is going to be able to attack the Kimura or anything else. So what you're going to see now is I'm going to sprawl my hips away from him. My shoulder's keeping his hips isolated. I'm going to sprawl my hips back. So if someone is really resisting me, especially if they're longer and not uh, taller than me, that's taking me two, three, four, five strong to get, to get his grip of Rarely ever do I get the first fall. So controlling his hip with his pants in my right hand over here. And my other arm is controlling his bottom leg, tucked away so I can protect. So I'm gripping his pants here, punching it up. My shoulder is on his far hip. What I'm going to do now is my knees and hips are going to sprawl away from my face. It's like a uh, takedown sprawl. So I do a little sprawl here. Reset. My shoulder just moved like half an inch. Sprawl. Reset. Sprawl. Reset. And now you see my left elbow is kind of creeping out slowly. So once it's vulnerable to his attack, I tuck it underneath. This arm comes underneath his leg. So now it's protecting the tip more of the toe. Right? Nope. You've got a split second and make the transition and maybe even try to catch it. He's still trying to hang on to salvage his half So he's still got his leg. I'm going to do one more. Once he's down here, he can hang on. I'm trying to pull my leg and stay at the period. I'm going to my leg one more time. Here. And now it's going to slide the bump. Take this one. Put your leg this way. Put your leg this way. And just walk. Put the side control here. So, what I'm doing are a bunch of little movements while protecting my arms from his common attacks. So I'm going to do it one time without a lot of talking so you can see how it progresses. Right here, kind of push in, boom. Right here, boom. Each time I'm recoiling for my sprawl. Right here. And that's the uh, entry to my whole uh, pressure passing system with all my leg laces leg locks, my dog bars, and all my other attacks. And that's how I start everything when they play the knee shield or half guard.